Schools across central PA are just weeks away from reopening and concerns around the coronavirus pandemic continue to circulate. School staff are working around the clock to make sure they're set for classes to start soon. Our team checked in with several school districts today on their plans to keep students safe. Our Sean Rapp has the latest from Forest Hill School District and their reopening plans. But first, our Colleen Knutson spoke with the Hollidaysburg Area School District about their second Parents' Choice Survey. Colleen, tell us why the district wanted to do this. Well, Amanda, the school district sent out their Parents' Choice Survey back in June, giving parents three options for their kids. Traditional face-to-face, -face, the school district Cyber Academy, or homeschooling, and 95% of parents say they want to see their kids back in the classroom. However, COVID-19 cases began to rise in Blair County just a month later, and the district decided to resend that survey to see if parents have growing concerns. What's the risk of going back versus the risk of, of him not having that social factor of being in school? James Baroner's son, Rob, is going to be a ninth grader at Holidaysburg Junior High. The plan for him is to return to in-person classes in a few weeks and ride the school bus. It was a little, a little of a struggle um, being uh, home and doing the school schooling you know, virtually. The school district is taking the appropriate steps. We're comfortable with, with the plan that they've put in place as of right now. James joins the now 85% of HASD parents who say they want their kids back in the classroom after the district resent out their parents' choice survey in July. And with less than three weeks away from the first day, Superintendent Dr. Bob Gilday says masking will be a responsibility that everyone must take seriously. Masking in the classroom, uh, social distancing in the classroom. Most of our buildings, we cannot establish the six feet of social distance. It's, it's just not possible. And if students are not following the school's protocol, High school principal Dr. Maureen Lutcher says they'll focus on educating them on how these guidelines are in place to protect them. That's what it, we're all about. We're about the students and, and we want to be with them. We want to see them and we want them to be together and have all those wonderful experiences that we were all lucky to have. As of now, the school district is planning on a full reopening on August 26 and says that their plan is evolving as more information becomes available. In Hollidaysburg, I'm Colleen Knudsen, WTAJ News.